If you're looking for a great premier print-on-demand supplier, I think Printful is a great option. Now in this video, I'm going to review a product that's near and dear to my heart, the Knit Beanie. I got two of them embroidered. One was light and one was dark, and I'll review them right now. By the way, I have a link, a bonus link, a free resource at the end of this video for anyone interested in taking their print-on-demand store to the next level, courtesy of Printful. If you've never heard of Printful before, here's a quick rundown. They're not a marketplace like Redbubble, Merch by Amazon, or TeePublic. What Printful does is they print products on demand and then they ship them to customers. So Printful is a supplier. Now I think this is a great option if you run your own online clothing store, for example. So rather than buying boxes of inventory and hoping that it sells, you can just list the products in your online store and then when a customer purchases the item, the order goes right to Printful. So Printful prints the design on the shirt or the mug or the hoodie or whatever the product is and then ships it to the customer. The customer does not know that Printful specifically printed the order. So if you're using Etsy, for example, your Etsy shop would be listed on the note that the customer sees when they open their package. I live in Canada and it's freezing cold a lot of the time. So I think it was time to order a knit cap or what Printful calls a knit beanie. Now I live in Canada and we call it a toque. So basically it's a high quality hat that you can put on your head to try to stay alive during blizzards. Yay for living in Canada. Okay, so here's a quick walkthrough on how I designed the beanie slash toque. Okay, let's have some fun with Printful. I'm on the main Printful page and I'm gonna put a link to Printful in the video description below. I'm gonna go here to products and then I'm gonna look for something like hats and then in here we've got beanies and I'm gonna click on beanies. As this loads up, I'm just gonna mention that the link to Printful in the video description below is an affiliate link and if you do click on it and you wind up purchasing something, I would receive a small commission. Here's the actual beanies that we're gonna be looking at. And the cap that I'm gonna be looking at here, we've got four up top, we've got a few toques down here. I like the pom-poms, but I'm gonna be going for this knit cap here on the right-hand side. It's knit beanie and it's auto cap 82480 and it's $14, and then there's a whole bunch of different colors here. So I'm gonna click on this. Okay, and from here I then get the option to choose my color. Pretty nice. And then it also shows me the price, and then I can just simply start designing. This is nice, really easy to use interface. I'm gonna to click the Start Designing button right here. Now it's going to ask me if I'm doing a basic order for myself, or if I'm doing a sample order. So a basic order would be like if I sold something and I wanted to send it to a client. A sample order would be for myself. So I'm gonna click on create my order as if I'm creating a sample for myself. Okay, and now it just asks me for the design and I can choose my file. There's also some product options here. I can select the different colors and then I can also choose my file. Now what I like here is it says product info pricing and guidelines and I can click on that and we can see here it even gives us a print file template. So we've got a max embroidery area, a front, and it even gives us a download file that we can actually download. It's just a little zip file. So knowing that the max embroidery area is five inches by 1.75 inches, so it's like a long, skinny rectangle, that's what I'm going to be using in my photo design software, five inches by 1.75 inches. So here I am in Photoshop, and I've got my image size here is five inches by 1.75 inches. My resolution is pretty much 300 pixels per inch. And it's a little bit hard to read here, but it just says crafty stacks. I've got a basically a white font that I'm gonna be using on my one beanie. And then for my other one, I created a PNG that says Zen water cooler with some funky lines in it. So that's the two designs that I'm gonna be uploading into my toques. Okay, so once the design is done in Photoshop, putting it on the actual toque here is pretty straightforward. So I'm just gonna click this, drop your design here, click the button, and then I can upload a new design if I wanted, but I'm just gonna use what I've got right here. I've already uploaded them, so I'm just gonna click the place button, and we can see now Crafty Stacks is on the toque. If I don't like the, the actual uh, color, I can just click product and I can select a different color, 
and I can see how it's going to look. I really do like the mock-up. It's showing me how it's going to look when it's actually embroidered, which is really nice. As you can see, white on white, it kind of looks a little bit gray. And if I do gray, you can see it looks a little bit white. And there's all sorts of different colors. Same deal here with the uh, Zen water cooler. I'm just going to click on it and delete it. I can click my drop my design and I can click my Zen water cooler one and that will show up as well. And I'll click black and it will pop up here. It looks a little bit silvery here. So that was it. And then from there, I'm just going to click continue. And we can see here the knit cap. It says it's black. The actual design is there. It's $14. Now I can continue to shipping here or I can just go back and I can create another. You can see there because this is a sample order, it actually gives me the discount right there. Discount $2.80. So overall, it's about $17.70. I would then just go back to my main page and I would just create another toque and I would then have two in here and then I could basically do up to three products in a sample order and then I could get it shipped right to my house. And that's what I did. I actually created two toques and I've got one that says Zen Water Cooler, one that says Crafty. And let's take a look at when the mailman showed up with them. Uh, this is a great day. Let me show you what the toques look like. Overall, I am so happy with the quality of these knit beanies. I think the fabric is simply amazing. It's thick and it will actually keep my head warm as I try to buy groceries in minus 40 weather. I love, love, love the embroidering on these toques slash knit caps. There is zero chance that it will rub off like a sublimation print or an iron-on print. The actual logos are woven right into the knit beanie. Simply amazing. I highly recommend this product if you want to sell something unique, especially for people who live in cold climates. I just think it looks really cool too. Okay, bonus link time. I mentioned at the start of this video that there was a free resource and I'm going to put that link in the video description down below. There's a great free guide called Grow a Fashion Brand in 2021 and it contains over 20 pages of tips and tricks and brainstorming ideas from Printful if you're thinking about starting or growing a fashion brand or an online store. It's completely free, so just click the link and then you can download it and you can check it out. I really hope you found this video review helpful. Nothing beats ordering a sample and then holding the actual physical product in your hands to see what the quality is like. And here's another Printful review that you'll find helpful.